Hello one and all, we are back playing the Terran, well, the Galactic Terran Commonwealth now. Thank you very much. Uh, so, what I'm thinking, uh, I was just looking at this because we're live, um, is that we are the only ones in our neighborhood that we know of that has FTL. These guys don't, they don't, they don't. And one of the things is, is like I've limited that we can only get hyperlane, so that makes it a little bit harder to get it. And we could have easily not have gotten it as soon as we did. Because it's the luck of the deck, right? So... I'm thinking... That we should start... Becoming... An actual empire. And these guys would be pretty good people to, you know, make our... Make our uh, make our vassals. We don't need allies. We need people to essentially fall in line with the empire. And what the planets? Yeah, we can't use their planets. So having them around wouldn't be too bad. These guys, though, we could use their planets. They're reasonably good people, so actually conquering them wouldn't be too bad. They're pacifist and fanatic individualists, but they shouldn't be able to hold up a fight. Like after we stomp their fleet. That being said, the hegemony over here has a huge naval capacity, so they've been, they've actually been actually colonizing, even though they, they themselves do not have FTL, so that's a little bit risky, because that means we can go around stomping their colonies. Because it's unlikely they've built up sufficient defenses yet, and we can always jump out. We have the, the advantage with speed. So, we're gonna start this right. We're gonna start... We're gonna make them, yeah, our vassals. Because we're not xenophobes. We are trying, however, to be an empire. Okay. So this is their capital. It's obviously going to have a star base, uh, a station already up. Does anywhere have a military academy? Did, was I wise enough to place one down somewhere? No, I don't think I have a military academy anywhere, so... It's probably just best that we just recruit our troops here. Well, we'll get one for now. Um, that being said, we'll go back. We gotta make sure her fleet doesn't fly to their doom. That being said, is our fleet top notch? Oh yeah, we had really good guns in this run. Oh, we don't have cold fusion reactors. I don't think that will make or break us, but... Oh shit, no, I like auto loaders. They're my friends. Um, That provides 20. Another shield would be too much, but... We could probably do this. And... Yeah, uh, I find more shield pretty good so we'll go with this for now uh, so our new ships will get this uh, but so we're gonna expand our influence we can't really use their planets this war has put a stepping stone yeah you'll probably be pretty good vassals a good subject state Because we're gonna 
I, I'm pretty sure we need to at least land on one of their planets. To make ourselves... So how big is their fleet here? Oh, that's really tiny. Now that we've got vision... Their space station, however, is really strong. So that's concerning. We do have space, however, for a few more of our Corvettes. So we might build up a few more as this war goes on, but we definitely needed troops to land. Yeah, this planet's not defended. They have two here? Research oh complete. lord. Size 7. Oh. On a tundra world. I don't want to destroy their infrastructure. I just, I want them actually to have it largely intact, because the whole point of this is to get resources out of them. Um, Construction we're militaristic. Why are we not taking advantage of the fact that we can bomb the ever-living shit out of them? Uh, orbital bombardment full? Yeah. We're a militarist empire. We are going to get our way. Mm. Human for life. Uh, that being said. So this was Cold Fusion. It's uh, the next step up from the nuclear power. I think we'll get that. I think we have a few of those around. Oh, we have Cloud Lightning. Eagle. To be researched, that'd be pretty useful. It's got a long range. But we can get this later. We we have it in our queue. Um, much better. This? Oh, that's only medium, though. I want to be able to put that on our Corvettes. That'd be on our destroyers. It is good in the range. Ah, in, in time. We'll get the cold fusion plant. I think that'd be a wise investment. Hmm... Just, just curiosity. Yeah, full. Construction complete. Paranoid. Yeah, that's a terrible trait to have. I wonder if our troops are effective enough. Uh, let's not risk it. Uh, let's just make sure we have the full, the full complement. It's not like they can strike back at us. We have. As I said, FTL superiority, and we should take advantage of the fact that we have FTL superiority. Research and they have two undefended planets, essentially, over here. Oh, that was the military academy. Now we can do it. So we're going to essentially form a federation by the force of our fantastic arms. We're going to be going in and we'll be like, our guns are better. So we got to take advantage of this. I was playing pretty passive till this point, but uh, we should take advantage of the fact that they can't, even if they were allies, it would take way too long for anyone to send supplies over. It took us forever to get to our next system with no FTL. So they can't be doing much better than we were at GameStar. Uh, is this a full complement yet? Mm, let's improve the army damage. Expeditionary. Oh, that makes me sad. <sighs> mm, good. The recruitment on Terra ha armies on Terra has been completed. No, 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 no. Remain in orbit till future. I don't want to exterminate them. The whole point of this is to uh, vassalize them. Not remove them from existence. If you want a genocidal game, like I could have easily made a, gen a xenophobic uh, empire, but um, hmm. I wanted to build an empire. Oh, a scientist died. Well, that's unfortunate. You're paranoid. Fuck. You have like this, but at least it didn't give you failed risk, so you're just slow. That being said, uh. Engineering. Oh, it's engineering. 
Uh, maybe. Most likely to get that in engineering than it. Sorry, excuse me, uh, than anything else. Hostile fleet engaged. No, 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 fuck. I didn't want to destroy their mining stations. How will they pay me? Situation updated. Uh, that being said, do they have... Um... They kind of have techs. Situation log updated. Hey you, are you busy? Not particularly. Go, like, get a sneak peek at their technology. You bond this. Uh, how are we doing here? Next question. Did we make sure our transports actually have FTL drives? Uh, given that it's on auto, no. Sublight, no. Uh, they don't need to be able to see very far. They just need to get here quick. The faster, the better. So now our guys have FTL. Close down that. Close down that. Embark all. Let's hope that this is enough. Oh, it's not there. How about would have been okay here? Okay. So we're going to put you guys on orbit there. We're going to get our armies and assign. Oh, you are terrible. You're exactly what I am at the moment, but... Uh, these are all terrible. Oh, well, let's get the one that'll live the longest, I suppose. Good job, Sergio. 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 Ortez. Ortiz. You were chosen because you are the least terrible. Land armies. Construction complete. Remain in orbit. Okay, maybe let's not bomb it because that event will keep popping up to an annoyingly long, like, regular degree. I like it, don't get me wrong. It's it's cool that this option to totally sterilize a planet is a thing, but... Yeah, like, but it lasts a long time. Like 60 months? That's, what, five years? Okay. I'm gonna research that one, that's not bad. Again, we're just taking advantage of the fact that aha, uh -huh, you can't get me is essentially what's uh, going on right now. We're children of space. Oh dear, they're just... Construction go work on this planet until the transports come back. We're gonna have to sit on it too. Mm, that should fill it our fleet capacity. And we're gonna lose a bit of it when we go flex our muscle, but uh, they'll pay the bill in time. They'll foot the bill of the Empire. Let's just put it that way. And they won't be able to fight back against us anytime soon. So, where are you? Oh, I think the army just came in. Oh, we don't care about rally points. Oh no, but uh, it's about to. So, let's get you guys bombing this again. Construction complete. Um, we'll just move you there for now. We'll wear down the last bit of the defenses again. We're terrible human beings. Shanty town, hydroponics farm, natural fuel sourcer. Good job, guys. Okay. Let's go land our armies. Let's System survey complete. get this war moving. Enemy planet secure. Damn. That was one-sided. At least we don't have to worry about them uh, coming back at us. Research complete. Okay. Well, we're not going to land them yet, so just enter orbit. Oh, we've got our mining. Next level mining that works with tech. 
do we want now? We don't use explosive. Let's get the next level. This. Expand our space yards. Um, let's build another set of soldiers. We might need it for the home world. Yeah, let's get the bio lab. And let's go see. Uh, there are mines to upgrade. Uh, can't upgrade these ones, actually. Okay. Please. Well, that here goes our little bit more last bits of our minerals. So, we're gonna continue on. We're gonna to invade everyone over time. Invasion over. We have successfully taken that planet. Construction complete. How does it form? Vampires. Demands money and power. Suppress. Well, that's cool. I didn't know uh, there was a cartel. Huh. Yeah, fuck you. Do not make me bring my empire there. I will bring my empire. Do you guys just want to surrender? I'll stop bombing you. Uh, what troops do you guys have? Just garrison. Terra, okay. Embark. Enter this orbit. Ah, good, let's land. Construction complete. How we doing? Kicking ass, taking names. Oh yeah. We might lose a troop. I hope not. Uh, I've got this. Fortifications are down. And we win. Okay. Um I'll get you to land, uh, for now. We are going to see if we can take the home world. Actually negotiate. Okay, they're not down with this yet. Might actually have to go in and uh tell them who's boss. Obviously me. Okay. Let's turn off aggressive. Yeah, turn off aggressive for now. Hmm. Cold fusion plant. Good. Um, when I do develop colonies, I want them to be quicker. Oh, so their fleet's there. Ah, oh, I wonder if we can catch it. Construction complete. If we can get it uh, without hitting their uh, fleet engaged, without getting their space station involved. Situation log updated. Situation log updated. System survey complete. Together, that's... Uh, yeah, let's go outside. Uh, you don't want to strike this yet? Okay. Hostile oh. fleet engaged. Excellent. We did not trigger the space station. We are losing ships, but they are losing them far faster than we are. Perfect. Now, with this, how are we looking health-wise? We're doing good. Let's go take this out then. 
that was enough. Self-aware ships, that's fucking creepy as shit. What are you talking about? The best possible outcome. Good! System survey complete. Have one person who is essentially our bitch, and they will eventually like us once, uh... Uh, you know, the malice goes away. So, let's go heal up back on Terra. Actually, let's go upgrade up on Terra. To the newer design of our ships. I think we'll eventually get something out of them. Or did we want to make them tributaries? They are loy. Wow. How can we uh, aid the reign of Jamal al -Samarai? Research complete. I don't know, my good sir. But eventually we can integrate you. I doubt we will. You're probably better to us as a, a buffer. Producing your own ships. It's kind of like having vassals. Oh, self-aware ships. I was... Oh, self-aware colony ships. You got a point. <laughs> that would be kind of creepy. But you can't deny its benefits. And, you know, we're materialists. We like our robots doing things that we want them to do. You're right, you did point that out. I, I didn't quite... Like, I've played this game enough that that doesn't shock me nearly as much as it should. Yikes. <laughs> ah... I have errored greatly though in one thing. I should have chosen a better border color. Something far more visible. That would have been a far better idea. Yes, dog. I am recording. I will be putting a cut in the episode soon. Yes, yes, yes. I will pet you. Okay, well, my fleet is... My army is over here, so... Uh, it's not like it's any better than anything else right now. I'll probably recruit elite troops Ships later. Construction complete. Yes, you can go up there. Hmm. Okay, System how are we doing? Complete. System survey complete. Excellent. Ah, uh, yes. We should be able to avoid this difference. Yeah? Yes. Perfect. Really? Yep, we're doing good. We're doing good. How are we doing over on Alpha Centauri? Good, and we are filling out nicely. We even have someone actually. How much food we got? 12? Oh, we have plenty of food. Uh, so much so that uh, this can be. That's a good question what this could be. It could be anything. Uh, what would benefit me more? Like, there's not enough here that I want to just, uh... Alpha Centauri, where are you? Oh, you're within... Pretty good range there. How much science are we getting out of this? Not a whole lot of science. You won't really do much, but I wouldn't mind... More of this. No. No, 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 actually... That's a, that's a water resource. What I want to build... Come on. Come on, brain. Where's the hydro? We're gonna put a big dam on this boy. There we go, hydro plant. Excellent. Uh, this is a food resource, we're not doing anything with it. We can easily give up two. Yeah, we can give up two. Uh, so I guess we can put a biomass furnace on it. What else have we got? Uh, I love helpful mod. It gives me a lot more to think about. Do we have cantina on this planet already? I don't think so. Yeah, we don't have cantina, so let's put a cantina down. Bring some happiness. People like to drink. I like to drink. I could drink right now. <sighs> Natural fuel sorcerer. Okay, yeah, we'll put that down. 
How are we doing? Natural fuels? Oh, we're not really using as much as we could. Hmm. Uh, before I started with very little and uh, now have plenty. Do we have a cantina down in this area? No, we do not. Cantinas are nice because uh, they bring up the happiness. Can't go wrong. Like, uh, to build it though, you need like a local source of the uh, synthanol, which brings up ethnic divergence, but we're still pretty, pretty tightly compact as an empire. We haven't really expanded out yet. And so long as like they don't get rebellious or funny ideas, it shouldn't be too bad. No, this should be a robot. Because we're just going to put a mine here. It doesn't have to... And... 11. Uh, yeah, this will be a fuel sourcer. So that'll be more food. Put you on that. This will be a hydro plant. Uh... We've got a lot of water resources here. I'll put a robot here. And uh, this can be a mining network. And then we'll put a robot there and it will be... Okay, it will be something. Most likely the mineral processing plant. It will give a plus one on both of these guys. This guy right here. And it will provide some more minerals more than the mineral silo. Mineral silo is nice, but actually we might put the mineral silo, silo right here. So ding ding again. And a human can work that because it provides no true major bonuses. And I'm trying to go for uh, like the run I did before as the humans, as the Terra Imperium. Uh, I'm going to try to get the AI, uh, the give them citizenship. That's my plan. That being said, I'm going to put a cut in the episode. Uh, I am going to continue recording online with YouTube. So as always, thank you for watching everyone. If you like, uh, please leave a like, uh, leave a comment. I'll try to get back to it as soon as I can. Uh, if you want to subscribe, that's great. And I uh, know, see you all next time.